Hi, I'm Nathan Sanderson, Executive Director of the South Dakota Retailers Association. Earlier this month, we shared information about President Biden's mandate that employers with 100 or more workers require COVID vaccinations of all their employees, or if they're not vaccinated, to pass a COVID test each week. Since OSHA issued its 490-page emergency temporary standard, a number of legal challenges have emerged. On November 5th, South Dakota joined 10 other states in opposing this mandate. And lawsuits seeking to stop it from going into effect have been filed in 11 of the 12 federal judicial circuits. You may have seen that recently, a three-judge panel in Louisiana issued a stay of the ETS. That's an order preventing this policy from being implemented on the grounds that it exceeds OSHA's legal authority. The court said the policy was, quote, fatally flawed and ordered OSHA to take no further steps to implement or enforce the mandate. The court's ruling is not permanent, but for the time being, it does stop it from going into effect. So here's what this means for South Dakota businesses. Businesses with fewer than 100 employees would not be impacted by this policy. Businesses with more than 100 employees do not need to implement the provisions of the proposal at this time. Because of the court's actions, the December 5th mask mandate deadline and the January 4th vaccination deadline are no longer in effect. The South Dakota Retailers Association will continue to monitor any developments on this issue and provide updates in the coming weeks. So to stay up to date, visit our website at sdra.org.